Right, hello everyone, Mr. Sunshine of Rolls Royce Technician Eddie coming to you live. And what we have here is a Rolls Royce. This came out of a Corniche convertible. This is the rear hub, and uh, we have to replace the disc rotor here. And in order to remove the disc rotor, this has all got to come off. The yoke's got to come out of here. Um, the bearings in here, there's some seals, there's some retainers. This has to come out in order to get down here and get these screws. All right, in order to be able to uh, go ahead and replace the rotor. It doesn't come out unless we have all of this off. So uh, this nut, which is a 43 millimeter nut on there, or uh, I think it's an inch and a 16th, um, is actually torqued on there to uh, 525 foot pounds of torque. So uh, we need to get that off. So uh, what we're going to do, I tried the uh, air wrench. I didn't have enough uh, CFM in my compressor to even attempt to get that off. I tried, it did nothing. So uh, we're going to use the Milwaukee Fuel Brand, the big impact wrench. Now this is the biggest, most powerful impact wrench uh, that they have on the market, I, I believe, on, for battery powered. So we're going to give this a try. I put my big battery in there. The M18, this is the XC6. Now I have a big 12 uh, battery, but we're gonna try it with the six here. And um, this is the socket. So we're gonna go ahead and we're gonna try this and see if we can get this on. That's gonna go on there just like that, nice and tight, 43 millimeter. We're gonna go ahead and put this on, remove. Gonna, it's kind of hard to hold it. And uh, I hope this doesn't spin, which I'm sure it's going to spin. So let's see if we can get this up here. There we go. We can leave it up there. Let's try this now. Oh, look at that. Oh, my. 525 foot pounds. And there's the nut. Actually, it's a little bit warm. <laughs> there you go. So there it is. Um, and then here we're going to have to press this out. And to press this out. Uh, we have a special tool coming. The tool actually clamps up on top of here, bolts here, bolts here, and then there's a long shaft that's threaded. It's all grade eight, heavy duty steel. And uh, it, by spinning it, we'll probably use the impact wrench. It'll actually pull this right off. There's a Woodruff key right here that keeps everything in line. So the, that's what we're gonna have to do to uh, pull that yoke in order to get down into the bearings, pull the bearings out, pull the retainers out, and then uh, get down here to these 12 point nuts here. And then we should be uh, able to replace the rotor and get it all back together. We're actually gonna cl clean all of this up. We're gonna uh, blast it and we're gonna polish it all up. So it's gonna look brand new when we get it all done. So there it is, the Milwaukee Impact Wrench does it again. Uh, right here in sunny South Florida.